Sometimes we worry about not being good enough at something. We're, we're not good enough at it, and we allow that to stop us from jumping in and, and giving it a try. And uh, by the way, I understand that feeling. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, I don't like to admit this because it's a little embarrassing, but I'm far too conscious of what other people think of me. I, I, I know, we're concerned. I, I, we're concerned that if we do try and then we mess up and we fall down and we fail, we're gonna look foolish and, and weak and that's gonna be embarrassing and everybody's gonna laugh. But the way things work in this life, the way that God sort of created life to unfold, is that we usually have to be fairly inept at something, especially if it's something worthwhile, something difficult. We have to be inept at it for a while before we ever get really, really good at it. In other words, we have to be bad at it first in order to get good. The competence comes after a period of incompetence. So if we don't want to try and do it because we're bad at it, we virtually guarantee that we will always remain bad at it and never develop any true proficiency. Hey, look, look, my, my friends, I say this to you in love. If there's something that you would really like to do, give it a try. Try, but be bad at it, <laughs> be bad at it for a while, make some mistakes, learn, learn. This is how we learn. This is part of life. This is part of achieving things in life. This is part of getting good at things in life. Be willing to try.